from six years ago, I have 2018's Charles Dickens' Christmas Carol. The classic novel with recipes. Pretty cool. Hardcover. So there is your synopsis on this bad boy. Kind of surprised they had uh, who was in, involved with this. I didn't even know this book existed. I really didn't. But I know Martha Stewart. I know Trisha Yearwood. She's pretty cool. They're both cool. I mean, they've had a great career so far. Even Martha, despite being locked up. <laughs> that was funny. So this has the story. I don't know where the recipes are. They're probably scattered throughout. So, hop on your TV to check all these cool books out. I always forget to mention that. Because if you watch it on your phone, you're only going to get to see a portion of the shit. And it'll be like squinting your eyes like, you can't see. Whereas if you're on your TV, if it's a 32 to eh, 85 inch TV, you'll be able to really see what the hell I got up on the TV. So, that's awesome. Ah, there we go. So, 33 pages in, you get your recipes. Great. Will they have pictures? I don't know. Oh. So these are quick and easy. I've had spinach salad. That shit's good. Oh, I taco salad is way better though. Love that shit. So recipes are labeled by their name and who made it. How much ingredients directions. Might have two pages. Might have none. So. Hmm. But that's cool that you get the story of Christmas Carol along with recipes. So for all you Christmas junkies out there, you act like it's fucking Christmas after July, after my birthday, July 5th. Fucking psychopaths. This is a good book for you. <laughs> I don't do Christmas. I really don't. Like, it's just not, I don't know, it ain't fun no more. But I'm glad there's pictures. It's good. You know me, I hate Christmas, I hate cookbooks without pictures. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go watch some of my book reviews on cookbooks. Let's see what I'm talking about. Uh, do I like a Christmas Carol? No, I really don't. I care less about this book. I don't give a shit. I thought, I thought when I got this, it was going to be a bunch of Christmas Carol recipes and stuff, but whatever. So, I won't be buying this book. But if you like this book, you want to try this shit out, go for it. But this is what you get inside of it. Yeah. Now I hear her song in my head. Yeah. Smashed root vegetables. Looks like mashed potatoes. I'm sorry, that looks so lazy. It looks like she just laid out asparagus and poured mayo on it. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Oh, it looks so bad. Uh, but the presentation of this book, excellent. If you're a Christmas Carol fan, this is a good book for you to have. If you don't care for A Christmas Carol, you hate Christmas, you don't like these books, you shouldn't be getting it then, or watching. Just saying. But, everybody has their favorites, everybody's got their choices. Is this a good combination book? No, yeah, I think so. Granted, it could have more recipes, obviously. Fruitcake cookies, really? Huh. Okay. Just surprised by that. I wish there were drinks in here. That would be cool. <sighs> but, oh well. Can't have drinks in this. Yeah, there's drinks missing. Oh well. So there's the artists. And there's where you can find them as well. So, that is that book. Pretty cool. <laughs> Whatever. Next.